Hello, it's Misa here and I'm back with another coloring haul. Um, I feel like this month has been really, really long for me. Um, I've actually been feeling really down and not myself this month. And what that means is I usually tend to splurge on coloring books because they're kind of my go-to splurging for when I'm down. I don't think that's a good thing, but it's what I do it, it makes me feel better but that just means I have a lot of coloring books this month so <laughs> let's get right into them yeah okay okay um first up is chibi girls the grayscale one this is the newest uh one where they combined the two books chibi girls and chibi girls 2 um I don't own any grayscale books so I thought this would be the perfect one for me to start with because I've seen so many gorgeous art with people colouring in um, these pictures with markers. And I thought, I want to try that. I don't own any markers yet. <laughs> so if you have any recommendations on good budget markets, please tell me in the comments below. I'd like to get some. Um, yeah, adorable. Really, really adorable. That's that one. Um, next one is also Jade Summer. I got the Kawaii Fantasy. I really, really adored the first fantasy book, the uh, Kawaii Girls. That was actually my first Jade Summer book, so I was really excited when they came out with this one. <laughs> That's so adorable. Uh, I really, really love their Kawaii style, Kawaii style kind of images. So, got this one. Um, next one I got is. Birds and Blossoms from Majori's Sarnet. I pre-ordered this because I love Majori's um, artwork. And yeah, these just filled with birds and flowers. I really love birds. I grew up raising birds. I had uh, two birds that I raised from as a baby. And yeah, me, the, I was just, I was just always with them. I even took them to school with me in primary school, so <laughs> that's how attached I was with my birds. So anyways, um, this book is her typical diddly kind of, I don't know, she's got a really unique artwork and I love it. So that's that one. Next is Mythographic Imagine. This just came out I think a few days ago and I think YouTube, ColorTube, has been blowing up with videos on this with flip throughs I haven't posted my flip through for this yet but I think by the time I post it everyone would see pictures from this book already and I must say the pictures are mind-blowing I was <laughs> speechless so just in awe of these images like it's so different from his first book the animals ones I liked his first book but this one is just out of this world I just Oh, look, look at these fish and it's a wolf and I don't know he, he's he's got a really great imagination I gotta say and oh it's from Joseph Kattenbang in case you didn't know <laughs> but yeah his this book is just wow um I noticed that this book is perforated as well so that's something new that I think the last book didn't have oh look at that turtle it's a really 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 gorgeous book I don't think I have any other book that's kind of similar with this. Even his old book and Kirby Roseanne books, they're not, the artwork's not like this. It's, it's this one's just, I don't know what to say. It's, it's wow. I, lo I love the fish as well. And I don't know. It's just wow. <laughs> Anyways, I think everyone's seen this book from everyone. <laughs> Next I got is this, uh, this Saga of Sakna from Emily Oberg. Um, this is, this has been around for a while, but I never picked it up. It was too expensive for me and it was still expensive when I got it this month, but, um, I just decided to go for it. <laughs> I was down and I just needed to splurge and so I got this. I don't know. It's, it's really bad. I, I just, I don't know. I need to stop buying so much colouring books. When I think about it, I don't even have anywhere to store it. But, anyways, her artwork in this book is beautiful. I think 
think everyone's seen this book by now, so beautiful. I'm very happy to finally have it. Okay, next book I got is Whimsical Darlings from Jana Prosverina. Verina? Sorry. <laughs> okay, um, this book has really cute images of girls. Um, this book is Create Space. It's a really thin Create Space paper, so that's a thing that you might want to know. But the images are just adorable. Very cute. So that's that one. Then I got um, Graceful Unicorns from, from Camellia Indrakova. I was so glad that she decided to come out with a non-Mandala book because... I, I prefer her, I really liked her mermaid one basically and this kind of remin reminisced to the mermaid book Oh, I might hear my dog barking up back there So this is, has really adorable pictures of unicorns I love unicorns I hope she makes a fairy one next <laughs> But, so, oh, there's a mermaid Really pretty. I really love it. Okay, next I got is Fun and Fanciful Mandalas from Kim Floden. Um, when I saw this, I was really intrigued by the artwork. It's like mandalas, but it also has Zendoodle inside the mandalas. So it was a bit of a fusion, and I thought it was really unique. So I decided to pick this one up. It kind of feels a bit whimsical as well. So, yeah. Thought it'd be fun. This is also on Create Space Paper. So, she has other Mandela books, but um, I don't know. I just really like this one. So that's that one. And then I got Springlings from Edwina McNani. This would be her newest one. Um... I noticed she didn't have a title page for this book. I think all her other books had a title page, so yeah. Um, as always, she has pictures with white background and black background. And <laughs> interesting I, to this page, there's a misprint on this book. There's two pages with misprints. There's a line through it. I actually got another, I got a new book. A replacement book from Amazon and the same thing happened so I think it's just an error for all her, for all the books for this um for this particular book so but the good thing is with this book you get a uh, free PDF which I'm not going to show you <laughs> there's a code somewhere in the book which you can get the free PDF and the PDF version would have no uh, line through that page so I could actually print that page out if I wanted to. But yeah, really cute book. Really cute images. I can't speak today. I'm sorry. So that's that one. Okay, next I got is Whimsical World number four from Molly Harris. Her Molly Harrison. I absolutely adore her whimsical images. I have all of them now, I think. Oh, except for the Halloween ones. I, I need to pick up the Halloween ones, but this is her newest one, newest whimsical one. She also had another one that she released, a fantasy one, but I didn't want that one. I didn't like the artwork in that as much. But um, yeah, this one's got her cute little images. I noticed this one, she has like a little bit of shading going on in this version of the book. Oh, sorry, in this book, number four. So, oh, I like this picture. And as always, it's on Create Space Paper. Oh, actually, this one feels a bit thicker, just slightly thicker than her old books. So, yeah. Really cute. I love it. I think this one probably one of my favourite favorite of her whimsical books. Uh, next I got Manga Heroines from Tiny Stealth. I think I showed a book also from Tiny Stealth called Chibius last month. And oh my god, that is... Oh, that is like Sailor Moon. <laughs> Not sure you can see it, but that's like Sailor Moon on this girl. I love Sailor Moon, so... So, 
this this book oh, there goes my dog again not sure you can hear him my dog loves barking at the postman that um, drives by and anyone that basically walks by my house so so there's this book really nice um then i got two books from sassy coloring they're actually drawn by sasha what's her name sasha her name is sasha uh, sash sash bleh. Sashka Cook. So I got Sassy Dreams. This is like a um oh mind blank. These these things um what are they called? Dream dream weavers? Dream, oh, dream catchers. Oh god. They're filled with dream catchers and I thought they were really uh whimsical looking. I've been looking for a um, dream catcher book for the longest time and when I saw this one I'm like yep it's perfect it's exactly what I've been looking for and so I had to grab that one the other uh, this one it's got so many different kind of wind captures and it's so nice oh that's not a wind capture I think at the back of the book she has pictures from her other books I think yeah so this one's from Alice in Wonderland Oh, but yeah really really cute dream catchers it's some um, create space as well so yeah and then the next one i got is called sassy collections um this book actually contains i think four or five collections that she has drawn let me see, see. so she's got the oh, sassy favorites is like just like pictures from her other books or yeah she's got an etsy shop so so there's these ones which is part of the um fairy fauna i really like these images and then she's got this cupcake um cupcake cuties filled with cupcakes then she's got these ones which are fairy flora I think they're really really adorable look at them <laughs> cactus and then she has these ones I, I i don't like these ones i think this is like some pin-up um yeah pin-up styles i really don't like pin-up styles and then she has these ones called oh, fairy bugs and yeah basically i bought this book for all her fairy images but not the pin-up ones i really don't like the pin-up ones so very cute book i'm so glad i bought it i might have to check out her other books as well but yeah that's next month's problem <laughs> okay next two books i got was from amanda byron i got her pretty girls with wings and things the volume one and volume two um volume one let's go so she's got really cute girls really really cute also on create space paper i believe I believe this um no <laughs> yeah this book has um duplicate copies of images so you get two two of the same images yeah i think you saw those really cute and this was her newest one that she just released i love this color combination of pink and yellow because they're my, my favorite colors so this book was just cute um, I don't know if this one has duplicate images though. But yeah, still very, very cute. I think this one might just be single image. But yeah, really, really cute. Um, next one I got is um storybook princesses, divas, villainesses, and heroes. Oh, let's say mouthful. <laughs> this is from Deborah Muller. <laughs> and um, basically just fairy tale characters that i don't know who these are <laughs> but i really love her artwork her style for some reason this book seems a bit more gray 
then her other book. She's not black looking, so we need to pick a liner. Oh, I know that's Wonder Girl, right? Ugh. But absolutely adorable. Alice in Wonderland. I know this one because it's got all these things. <laughs> it's funny how she, um, this is not, because this image is hand drawn and then she has three kisses that is not hand written. It's a bit odd. So that's handwritten. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, very, very pretty book. I really love Deborah Malam's book. Ah, uh, cool. This one's also from Deborah Muller. This is a posh coloring book. This is Soothing Inspirations. Um, I actually wanted this book for a long time, but I kind of forgot about it. <laughs> but then I saw it on... Oh, oh my god. It's been such a long month. I saw it on someone's channel, someone's collection video. Um, I'm sorry, I forgot who it was. But um, I saw it and it reminded me that I wanted this book, so I went and bought it. Really nice book of images with nice inspirations. I really like the style. This book is a bit smaller than other books. It's got like rounded corner as well, but I think it's nice. Paper is a little thin, but uh, it's thicker than her other Deborah Muller books, so mm. very nice inspirational book. I think I'll put this in my bag and bring it with me if I feel like it. Um, next book I got is from Sherry Boldy. I've been loving Sherry Boldy's latest books that she's releasing and Little Houses, and um, she's actually released. A new a few new books and I'm loving her new style that she has um I didn't like her old books before like her her um characters just looked unfinished or I don't know like alien like but her newest books which I I will probably show you in my next haul because I already ordered them and they're coming I fell in love with her new art style seriously anyways this one is called um flower town home is where the heart is and it's just little houses with a uh, love theme. I think perfect it was for Valentine's maybe. And it's just really whimsical and cute looking and I just I love this book. It's even, I really love it. As always she has like two copies of each image. And yeah, being breathless. <laughs> I need to take a break, sorry. <laughs> So, yeah, really, really cute, and I can't wait to get her new books. Um, I am absolutely in love with her new, her new books, and I am getting every single one of them. And yeah, next one I got is Kawaii Love Books. This is from Mindful Coloring Books. Um, <laughs> I actually picked this book up because I bought the um the Chibi Girls book and there wasn't any other books that I wanted to buy at that point and I really wanted to buy the Chibi Girls book at the $3.99 so yeah I decided to pick this book up with it because I, I feel like the shipping wasn't worthwhile if I just bought one book so yeah so this one's just got little bugs and in love and there's one picture that I really really like um, let me try to find it. Um, oh, this one. I really like this one. It's got pancakes and uh, some sort of rodent. <laughs> but I really like this image. It was so cute. That's pretty much why I bought this book. Yep. It's more childish, but it's good to have some of these kind of books in your collection. So there's that one. Uh, next two books I got is from Amanda Sansone. I don't know why I keep buying her books. <laughs> but um, she always has dessert themed books. And I follow her on Instagram and I love her. I love her dessert books. Uh, dessert images. They're so creative and out of this world. And I just really like them. So <laughs> I love this image. It's so nice. I just wish that she um uh in, uh had darker line art maybe with like go, went, go over it with pen or something 
Oh, so pretty. I really like her dessert. But I don't like how she has like these filler 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 pages with just random stuff, but yeah. I really like her bigger dessert images. Yeah, like this. So that was mermaid desserts. And then I got spectacular desserts. I don't know what's up with the printing of this. It's so pixelated. I, I it's not that it's not like that for the other books. This one just I don't know, the printing on the cover is just kind of rubbish. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I don't like pages like this. It's just really disappointing. But yeah, like this. But I like images like this. I mean, she's non-stop creating um, colouring books. I can see why she has pages like this, but I think she should take a break here and there and, I don't know. Produce some nicer books. With... This one has too many filler ones. I was really hoping that this book would have a lot of these big image, big desserts like this, but this book just had so much filler and I was kind of disappointed with it. But these, I, I love these ones. There's no doubt that I love these pictures. But just wish there wasn't so much of those little filler ones. <laughs> so there's that one. Uh, next book I got is I Love You. This was a Valentine's book and it's for kids. It's, it's so basic like this. But I just, I like the simplicity of this book, basically. <laughs> That's so cute. Um, it's very whimsical and yeah, it's just really simple and fun. Pretty thick book. It's a pretty thick book, so I think it's create space paper as well. So yeah, there's that book. I really like the look of this book. I know it's just pretty. Okay, next three books I got are these three little little pocket books. Um, I saw this one coming soon. At when I had this on pre order actually. And I love Now Wars. I love Needle Corns as well, but I also love Now Wars a lot. So when I saw this, I'm like, I'm going to try this book. Um, this book is actually from um, Jesse Echo. <laughs> so cute. So it's just got little cute little Now War images. I love these little books. I've become kind of addicted to them. I'm getting more of them. There's this one. These pages, the, the page is actually pretty thick. It's not like thick thick, but it's like medium thickish, so yeah. I only use pencils, so I don't really know what that means. <laughs> I really like this image. So there's now was. Oh, I was actually a bit disappointed that this wasn't foiled. Like the old one, this one has foiling, silver foiling. And when I pre-ordered it, the image had foiling on it, but when I receive it, it's just white, so a bit sad about that. <laughs> yeah, and then I also picked up I Love Unicorns, because I like the Now Wars one so much. So this one's also from Jessie Echo. It's really cute unicorns. Really simple. I like how they're one-sided, and then you have like a random little pattern here. You can colour them if you want, but they make nice back. Uh, yeah, <laughs> so that's the unicorns one. And then I decided to get I love, oh, I had colouring. This one is, I think the first, the very first book that they released from this I Heart series. And this one's um, by Felicity French. This one's actually double-sided. So it's very whimsical this one and has random images I thought these are really cute I prefer these kind of images the more whimsical ones over the pattern ones oh that's a really nice Mandela very whimsical feeling so those are those two I actually ordered I actually got a few more of these little books coming. <laughs> so, yeah. Really love them. Okay, next two books I got are these two. 
This is from Christine Glorysink. She has a she sells these on her Etsy chan uh, her Etsy shop. Um I think it's called Mystic Mystic Art or something. Um, I think it's Mystic Art, but these have been popping up all over Color Tube recently, I think because oh my gosh, it's either Sammy or Claire <laughs> who showed them. Um, but I actually saw these books on I actually saw this book on the channel from Jay, Coloring with Jay, and I thought wow, <laughs> like you should see the images are just so unique. The style. Look at them. Like first of all, I love mermaids. So when I saw this on a channel, I'm like, yeah, I gotta have this. Like the nose is kind of, I don't know, put me off a bit at first because I wasn't used to it. But um, yeah, the more I looked at it, the more I appreciated it and loved it, and I, it was just so gorgeous. The paper is super, super thick, super, super thick. So yeah, <laughs> I guess you can watercolor on these. But really, really gorgeous images. Really gorgeous. So this book is her second book, Mermaid and Friends. Um, so she has her new mermaid images. And then at the back, she um, features some of the images from her first book. Like from this book. And yeah. Beautiful. So this is the first book. Oh wait, her, her Etsy shop is called Mystic Art Mirrors. So, I kind of like her mermaid one a bit better. Look, there's a bit of nudity here. Oh, cute fish. So, I decided to pick up both to save on um, shipping costs. But, um, I heard that she has a new book coming out as well, a storybook princesses so i'm very excited to see that one hopefully it comes out soon my dog is barking again not sure if you can hear it okay the next book i got is from rita berman uh, i think this one walk with me through the seasons maybe i think it was roughly translated to but um, yeah, I've been seeing her um see the Four Seasons book that she has all over YouTube, and I just never bought them because I don't know why I never bought them. <laughs> I think back then I had a problem with like buying books that are not in English, and but now I have accepted that <laughs> that I can't read everything that I buy, so that's okay. So there's this one. So this book is the one that combines the four books and only has the, I guess, her best images, I guess. So you have, my dog keeps barking. So you have summer, spring, autumn and winter all in this book. And it's just so beautiful. I love, I love the artwork. It's very nice. And whimsical. Very pretty. I'm not sure if I want to get her up her four books though. I'm kind of wanting to get the summer book because I really, really, really like the images in the summer book. But then if I get that one, I feel like I want to get the other three so I can complete the collection. So I don't know. Okay, so that's that one. And lucky last book I got was this one, this Chinese book. Um from called Fallen City. It's got this little dust cover. This is a tiny little dust cover. And I got this book from AliExpress. All the other books I got are either from Book Depository or Amazon, but this one I got from AliExpress. It comes with a few little cards. So you got the image and the card on the back. So there's this one. Okay, so this book has some teaches you how to draw at the beginning, and then it um, has pictures of ancient uh, girls, and they're nice. 
but I mostly bought this book for I'll show you so half of these books have these kind of images these kind of images and then the other half of the book are chibis and that is why I bought this book because chibi the chibis I have never seen chibi chibi um uh, chibi versions of ancient Chinese drawings and characters and when I saw this I'm just like oh, yes I love chibis I gotta have this and so yeah so it's got chibis chibi chibis I really like them I hope we can see more image like coloring books with chibis instead of those like those really pretty and delicate looking girls because these chibis are adorable So, so cute. There's 25 chibi images and 25 of the other images. Let's do a flip of the other ones. I kind of prefer the um, the images from Da Da Mao instead. Th those are the other collection of Chinese. That's really cute. Chinese books that I collect. But um, yeah. I got these for the chibis. Really, really cute chibis. And that is just the back of this book. And that's all the colouring books that I got this month. <laughs> there was a lot of them. A lot of them. Oh my gosh. A lot, a lot, a lot of them. Let me just pull them down. <laughs> these are just all the books I got. Um, I would have flip throughs for all of these on my channel. I think most of them are up already and a lot of people have already seen them. But... There's a few that I still need to put up and um, yeah, if you liked this video, please give me a thumbs up. Um, if you like to see more of these kind of videos, I uh, do hauls every month and I do flip throughs of every single book that I get on my channel. So if you like that kind of stuff, please do subscribe to my channel. And um, if there's anything you want to say, comment, recommend, please comment below and let me know always like to hear new things i think um i may want to start investing in coloring supplies <laughs> pencils and markers so if you have any recommendations please do tell me below um i am currently using mainly pencils and gel pens um i'm using mako renoirs right now and i'm really liking them but i do want to get other stuff so i can try other stuff as well so yeah so thank you for watching see you next